I just need to get back to the fortress. That's literally all I need to do. Ooh, baby, don't fall down there. Okay, well, I d I'm definitely not. Th this is definitely not the way. So, gotta go down. You gotta go towards positive Z, dude. Gotta get that positive Z going. Go for the Dragon Ball Z instead of negative positive Z. Ooh. Oh god. Oh god. Uh oh. I'm gonna die. I've died. Oh no! But I, my stuff should still be there, right? Alright, it'll, it'll, it's there. Does, if you're in the area, it takes five minutes to despawn, so. Yeah, I'll, I, I'll right. be good. Yeah, like amount of deaths doesn't. Okay, here, let me. I, I just wanna get back to my home first. Uh, I'm running back there now. Well, I'm, I'm running to try and get my stuff again. Oh, you still wanna try it again? Okay, sure. Yeah. Cause I'm not gonna remember, dude. Yeah. Just need to put a sticky note. Remember stuff. Worst case, if this ends up being like another like twenty minutes, it's just like welcome to the new episode right now. <laughs> That's true. I guess hey. I could just cut it. Hi, hey, baby. This, hey, this is the new episode. What what's up? Hey, soul sister. Neck horse. Mm, put it in my duck belly. <laughs> There's this uh, YouTube channel I used to, or yeah, well, I guess I used to watch now. I don't know if you've heard of it, SourceFed. Yeah. Um, they got shut down by Discovery. Yeah, I heard. And then, did you hear what happened just recently with them? Mm, Have no. you ever heard of Now This? Yeah. They bought out that channel, and now they, they rebranded it to Now This. And good God, the shitstorm on those videos. They're, Why are they really, really bad? Well, it's, it's like they fired all the SourceFed hosts because uh, they had like they had like a normal news channel and then they had like a uh, a nerd channel, right? And they bought out the nerd channel and they changed the name or the the original name was SourceFed Nerd and then they changed the name to Now This Nerd, and then mm -hmm. their first video was saying we're the same as these guys. So they essentially fired all the original hosts just to make the same exact show, and uh, no one's oh, really happy okay. with I that. See how that. That that's yeah. definitely bad. Yeah. City. Oh yeah, definitely. And they they essentially like bought out a million subscriber channel just to like you know hey here's our corporate junk, and uh, yeah everyone's pretty unhappy about that. It's a really shitty yeah. move by now this because I, I now this usually is like not oh total God. trash. Apparently they've done this before. I've never I've kind of I've heard the name before, but I've never really known much about them. But apparently oh, their they main actually... thing is they do like um, Facebook videos that are like oh, really? that basically like know. compile news and like make it really like uh, right. get, like short, quick, easy to digest stuff. Right. Okay. Yeah, you know, what? come think about it. I did see someone say like this is in Facebook. I didn't really get the reference, but that that makes sense now. But yeah, so it, it, I see it a lot because uh, I go to a more liberal college and now this mm -hmm. tends to have a more liberal leaning politically. Yeah. Uh, so the, I see a lot of videos shared by friends up here, uh, by them a lot, hmm. um, about like, you know, oh, Trump said this and that means this and whatever, you know, this, stuff that, like that. And the things. Yeah. Interesting. Um, yeah. So the, yeah, just, I have never seen like a huge, <laughs> like dislike ratio compared to like them. It's like insane. It's like 200 likes to like thousands upon tens of thousands of dislikes like holy crap like i've seen backlash before but that is insane uh, i guess there's like stuff like the call of duty trailers and stuff that get even worse but yeah <laughs> just sucks Damn. what do you think of uh since uh speaking of dislike videos like the call of duty trailer mm -hmm. uh what do you think of the new announcement there Cause that wasn't that was like everyone was like oh my god this is like the Call of Duty I want and I'm like but it's like the same game still. Um well I don't really I don't really ever play first person shooters a whole lot so I yeah don't I, really... <laughs> I don't either but I yeah. just always like to take interest in that kind of stuff I guess yeah the, yeah. the shooter I'm excited for is Splatoon 2 baby woo so I... are you gonna get arms? <laughs> that looks Arms. so stupid yeah. but like i'll get it yeah i mean like when i have money i'll get yeah. it i don't know if i want to get that one or not i'm definitely gonna get splatoon 2 mario odyssey i'm looking forward to as well uh, that's actually another script i'm working on all right like, uh, i'm not saying i'm i'm not saying i'm not excited for mario odyssey yeah but i want i want the game that no one else wants yeah, i want super mario world. 3d world mm -hmm. 2 right yeah 
Yeah. Um, and no one else wants that. Everyone else is like, no, 3D World was bad. I'm yeah. like, no, 3D World was fantastic. Uh, and I want more of that. But everyone else is like, no. I mean, yeah, I, I like how it kind of mixed in, like, you know, the Super Mario World and, like, the our, like the Super Mario 3D stuff together. But I do, I would, like, if it, I would definitely much rather have, like, a Mario Sunshine-esque game over another 3D World game any day. I get that. Yeah. But, yeah, I mean, diff- uh, not everything's for like, everyone. Yeah. Yeah, that's why it's important, like when you like talk when you talk about those kind of things, to like consider that people just like different things. Yeah. Like um, one of my big issues, and I, I like, I, I've done a lot of like random like introspect, not random, but like I've done a lot of introspection over the past like few weeks or so, mm-hmm. uh, for just for a variety of reasons, just because a lot of shit going on in my life or whatever, right? Mm-hmm. Um, and um. One, one of my big issues is the assumption, right? And I think a lot of people have this problem too. Uh, the assumption that basically uh, everyone else functions the same way you do. Yeah. You know? And that everyone else does the same things that you do. Uh, when that's just not the case. Yeah, definitely. And yeah, I mean, not yeah, I mean, not everything has to be like something everyone's going to like. And things are just meant for yeah. certain people. Oh no, a skeleton killed a bunny. I don't know. I'm not, I mean, like, I'll get Mario Odyssey. I'll probably get it. Like, I'm probably getting a Switch sometime this summer mm-hmm. uh, around Splatoon 2 or something like that. Um, depends on a lot of factors, uh, one of which in- involves uh, um, uh, SGDQ. I might end up going. Oh, really? That's cool. Yeah, well, what happened was... Uh, oh. um, I, I, I don't think he'll care. Um, hat wearing gamer, Scott, he's coming to America. He's going on like a three week, you know, tour, I guess. Not really a full tour. He's going to three cities. Mm-hmm. And the last destination is SGDQ. So the idea is that I go and he goes and I meet him and other YouTube people that I know. That's cool. So yeah. That'd be interesting if that actually worked out. Um, yeah, I'm not going to be there the full time, though, because that's a lot of money. Yeah, like, yeah, the thing with those ships, they cost a billion dollars each. Well, like the um, the passes, yeah. for example, right? The passes are like, I think, 75 is what it was. And you have to buy them super early because, like, they, they fill up super quick. quick. Yeah. I mean, they're, they're, it's not like MAGFest levels, or not MAGFest levels, sorry. It's not like PAX East levels mm-hmm. of immediate, but, like, it, it goes out. They go pretty quick, yeah. right? Yeah. Because there's only so much space, and it's a very tight-knit sort of thing. Mm-hmm. Um uh so um uh i think it was 75 dollars, but the real cost comes in with like hotel costs and food costs yeah and flight costs and all that and so uh i had to, I had to do a lot of math to figure out whether that was like even a viable option for it, you. feasible uh just because you know on the street. It, it, i mean uh you know being a college student you're poor <laughs> especially in yeah. america you're in a lot of debt uh on the plus side uh, of doing that over having like a job or anything is you could just kind of get up and do stuff like that it's much easier to do that instead of like you know if you had like a day-to-day job where you'd have to like take holidays and figure out if it'd be okay for well, i mean i am work yeah I, I am working over the summer so i will have to request those days off oh yeah it. okay fair enough uh, yeah i will have to request those days off but the the system just by the nature of it being more of a summer job for most people yeah it's easy uh, enables that. it to be uh much more slack. more feasible yeah because a lot of the people that work there are high school students or college students and so they're only working that uh, so much time and they understand the fact that people go back to college at different times people have different mm. responsibilities so it, the, the system isn't like oh you have x amount of days that you have yeah. to take off it's more along the lines of let us know a certain amount of time in advance. And if you don't, you know, if you don't show up to a lot of shifts, then like, well, you're just not going to get paid for those shifts and yeah. we'll give them to someone else who will take them, you know? And also it could affect like you getting more shifts in the future. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So if they're like, this guy takes a million days off. Don't get yeah. no shifts. There's one, there's one kid last summer at the golf course I worked at um, who like he, his family just went on vacation like all the time. Mm-hmm. And so like, it, it was like that he'd be here in for a week and then like that'd be it and then you'd just never see him again <laughs> like wow. well that's like yeah. no <laughs> okay i'm almost back on my stuff what's our time at uh we're at around 32 ish minutes so do you want to just go all the way to 40 might as well go the extra 10 minutes okay let's do it then 
I need a helmet. Oh, there's my stuff. It's it's there. Some of it is gone, but a lot of it is here. Probably burned up then. Yeah, it fell off. But the shield's oh, here, off, right. and I've got to run now because I gotta re-equip my stuff and not get burned. Did 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 I don't have pants, so that's problem number one. That's is the disgusting. lack of pants. Uh, I have a, I have two swords. Uh, yeah. Okay. Well, uh, <laughs> this is gonna be interesting. I'm, my problem is I'm terrible at combat in this game. So like I it, me too. Like Hi Dudo. You gonna, gonna shoot me? Protection two, that's what I want in my belly. Great. Shoot me, dude. I'm gonna block what? you with my shield. Oh my god. Stop flying! Feather fall. Oh, there we go. Protection too. Ha ha! I did okay. it. Okay. Killed him. Got nothing. Good. From a blaze? Yeah. Well, you should. Just experience. You should get good. Ha ha! Me. What? What the heck? Okay, why aren't dudes spawning oh, out of it? Is that what I did wrong here? It takes some time. Careful. Normally, I know sometimes when it happens, you get a. Uh, a lot of things spawn Oh, it's spinning once. now. That means it's going to spawn a dude, right? If it spins. Yes, correct. Really? I don't have levels for that. Gosh, dangers. Dang, rain, baseball. Oh, there's a blaze all the way over here? Where did you come from, dude? Um, it's pronounced blase. In my belly. Can you, you can't enchant shields, can you? Or Hi, can. Skellington. Hello! Would you cry if hey, it's... Yeah, I, got, I get bones and arrows from him, but I don't get any... Oh. Fuck, I don't get any blaze rods, of course. You gotta ask nicely. Why would I get that? Uh, for bread. Bread! Okay. Let me, let me heal up. Oh my god. So I killed two blazes to no avail. We're doing great. I believe in you. Oh crap! There's some of them are spawning underneath the platform. That's why they're not spawning. Uh, one more, please. There we go. Oh no! I walked straight into fire. Oh yeah! Hmm. Oh, here we go. Oh, I died again. <laughs> yeah, those guys. You die pretty quickly to them. Uh, well, luckily this time they didn't. There, I didn't fall into lava because I was in a room. So everything that was in the room should theoretically be still in the room. Starring Tommy Wiseau. Question is, are you gonna have enough time to get back this time? I will. Because oh. I, I, I the, the, yeah, I will. Ooh, will I be, can be able to continue fighting? Probably not. I'll just be there and like we'll fight next time and then have to make my way back a million times. But million. at least there's a set route now. Yeah, that's good. If there's some areas you still kind of get confused getting to, you should probably put some courses on them so that way when you start up next time, you're not like, I don't know where to go again. You know? Oh, well, too late for that. <laughs> All right, just a suggestion. Oh, I'm already like well in, and I'm not gonna go backtrack and do that. You could you're you're right. I but... believe in you. Ooh, protection two. I like that one. Give me that one. Yeah. Oh, I need level sixteen again. Curses foiled again. Dang it. Give me levels. Give me pizza. P i z z a. <laughs> hmm. Oh, hey, it's a ghast. What up, ghast? Oh shit, what up? It's gonna casually walk by you. If they drop their tears, you can use it to uh for regeneration potions. That'd be cool if I had a weapon with which to kill them. You could reflect their shots back at them. With my fist? Yeah. Just You, know. you can? Yeah. I don't know you could do that with your fist. <laughs> you just punch a fireball? Yeah, it, it does actually work. And so you could use anything to hit the fireballs back. So stupid. You could even use a chicken. A rotting piece of flesh. This fish. 
<laughs> Can you hit back blaze fireballs at them? No. It's inconsistent. Bugs. Me. Yeah, <laughs> I was gonna say I never really thought about that before, but yeah, that is kind of a little bit inconsistent, isn't it? Just, just, just give me like, I just need a tiny bit more of levels, dude. Oh my god. Oh my god, you're a big mama. Oh my god! Holy crap, that hurts a lot! A lava slime hit me and did like four hearts of damage. Unbelievable. Good. Oh my um, god, I'm gonna die to him. I'm gonna die to him. Um, how far can you jump? Oh, kind of far actually. I don't like it. Going slow slam? This is a this is not a good time for me. Come on and slam. And welcome to the jam. The monkey jam. Are you kidding me? There's a freaking evil man after me. I'm an idiot. I just walked into lava, but we're fine. I'll just be lower on health when I get to the fucking place. It's all good. So good, sucker. Oh my god! Where'd you come from? Actually, there's a chance that this might kill me right off the bat. Oh, nope. One heart left. Okay. GG's no wheeze. I hate, I hate, I hate. I should have brought more food. Whatever. <laughs> I like how you forget something every time. That's silly. I think that's part of the reason why I like uh, Dark Souls and stuff is because every time you die, you just come yeah. back with like all of your all of your healing stuff, so you don't need to like plan it. You're like, oh well, I have like this much Estus every time, so mm -hmm. I can just go run out again. I guess that's kind of the problem with games that you lose all your items when you die with in general. Mm -hmm. For shit like this, where there's like a million different things. God dang it, freaking! I think Terraria, 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 whichever one you want to pronounce it, I think that did it best because you have multiple settings. Mm -hmm. so you can set it so you just lose your money, which yeah. is the setting if you want to play long term. Yeah, uh, you lose all your items, which is like higher stakes, but then also there's the hardcore mode where the world gets deleted, which is like, whoa, that's crazy. Minecraft has a hardcore mode too, but like. They just updated Terraria, hey? Like a uh, I don't week remember. ago? I think it was, just, it was mm. like a week. I, th I don't remember. I someone in my uh, one of my live streams was telling me they added like a creative mode. I think nothing like too like crazy game changing. Like I don't think they like added any more bosses or anything. But mm. did they ever add Akram, like the console Terraria final boss, to uh, the PC Terraria? I don't think so. It's so weird and inconsistent and bugs yeah. me. It's like if you're porting a game to another system, there should not be any differences. I think it's to... I would imagine it's to like, hey, buy both versions. I'm assuming that's why that was a thing. No, that's... I mean, the PC I final so. boss is, like, really cool. Yeah, oh, yeah. Is that not in... I guess that's not in... Not in the console version. Yeah. yeah. I, I like how you get to the point where you can just farm the final boss. Yeah. I don't like how impossible it is to beat the stupid... Uh, um, the the winter event. Like, get I've through never all the ways. Had to do the winter event, so I, I couldn't tell you. There's like a bunch of ways, but it's like it's not that you can't beat it. It's just that you only it, it, those like there's like a Halloween event. I think there's like a Thanksgiving event. I might be wrong about that one. And you got to get through like 15 waves of enemies in the span of one night. And if it turns a day, then it ends. It's relatively easy to do it on in like the Halloween events, but you cannot do it unless the only way to do it for the the Christmas events. It's like get a bunch of other worlds, take all the traps from like the jungle temples or whatever they are, and like make like a farm. So that's like the one thing I did. I refuse to do in that game because that's just ridiculous. Yeah. It's just ridiculous. Ridiculous. Protection two. Hmm. What do I need? I need pants. I think. Protection two. There we go. I did it. Oh well, I died by falling down. <laughs> All right, uh, we're at forty minutes now, so I could just um, remind you. Will my you stuff, stuff despawn is. if I just like quit? Nope. It'll still stay there, right? Yeah, it just it stays there forever. Okay, then that's fine. We'll call it. Okay, thanks so much for watching, everybody. Peace out, Girl Scouts.